Good morning, everyone. My name is Mighty Stream. I'm going to do your October the 24th just for today in a meditation. I hope you're doing well. Let's go ahead and get into the meditation and see what the title is. Responsibility. Responsibility. Okay. We are not responsible for our disease, only for our recovery. As we begin to apply what we have learned, our lives begin to change for the better. And that comes from basic text, the basic text, page 91. The further we go in recovery, the less we avoid responsibility for ourselves and our actions. By applying the principles of the Narcotics Anonymous program, we are able to change our lives. Our existence takes on new meaning as we accept responsibility and the freedom of choice responsibility implies. We do not take recovery for granted. We take responsibility for our recovery by working the 12 steps with a sponsor. We go to meetings regularly and share with the newcomer what was freely given to us, the gift of recovery. We become involved with our home group and accept responsibility for our part in sharing recovery with the still suffering addict. As we learn how to effectively practice spiritual principles in all areas of our lives, the quality of our lives improves. Just for today, using the spiritual tools I've gained in recovery, I am willing and able to make responsible choices. Let's take a moment of silence followed by the wee version of serenity prayer. Moment of silence now, please. God, grant us the serenity to accept the things that we cannot change, the courage to change the things that we can, and the wisdom to know the difference just for today, please and thank you. Okay, so we're talking about responsibility today and the beauty, the beauty that comes with responsibility. We're responsible for our recovery. The beauty that comes in that process doesn't always feel beautiful. It doesn't always even look beautiful, right? But in the end, having the responsibility for our recovery, one, it's a full-time job. And if you are acting responsible for your recovery, there are probably certain things that you aren't doing anymore. And there's probably certain things that you are doing. But one thing that I know for me personally being responsible for my recovery, it's a daily process. It's a daily act of making the right choice, not only for the right reasons, but at the right time. There's this tendency of mine to want to procrastinate, especially when I think the encounter is going to be negative. I might be faced with um, judgment or something like that. The encounter sometimes I will put off making a decision or acting because I don't want to deal with the consequences of the choices I'm making, right? So I will procrastinate. And even if the decision is, you know, nine times out of 10, what I perceive to be healthy for myself, I still will push off making that decision. So the right timing is also a part of being responsible. If I am responsible for my recovery and let's say I need to use the vehicle to drive, to go somewhere. 
I have a responsibility to keep my vehicle insured. There's a time that that has to happen. There's a grace period for the payments and then it laps. So that timing is important. And it's a part of me being responsible, not just in the sense of quote unquote, my recovery, but the things that come along with it, some of the blessings that I've received. So being responsible sometimes can have a time factor involved with it. And a lot of times people that procrastinate, they miss that mark because they are avoiding something or whatever with me usually it's just rejection but with that's me giving you the most simple example of being responsible for my recovery some of the things that have come with it also require for me to be responsible in a timely manner right so today what I would like for you to do is to think about how you are acting responsibly the second paragraph um, we're responsible by working the steps with our sponsors, going to the meetings, helping the newcomer. These are different things that we can be responsible for, right? Show our responsibility for our recovery. But there's other ways too. And I want you to look at that because sometimes it's not the not so obvious ways. Taking care of your bills, taking care of yourself, uh, making sure when you make engagements with your children or your family or someone else that you actually keep them. You don't blow them off. If you're making a, uh, um, an appointment with your sponsor to cover the step, make sure that you show up on time and maybe even a little bit early, right? Um, so there's different ways today. Just be responsible and enjoy it. Enjoy your recovery because we are living a different life than we lived before in active addiction. It's one of the most beautiful things I can say that I have encountered. My name is Maddie Stream. I've enjoyed talking to you today. I hope that you have a beautiful day on purpose.